Well, and today is something good. We have not the tale of two cities, but the tale of two murals in the city. Both are magnificent and they're really hard to miss. Mm -hmm. And the first one is of Tom Savini, the Hollywood makeup artist and Pittsburgh native. Artist Jeremy Raymer painted a portrait of Savini of a house on 40th Street in Lawrenceville. Yeah, and Raymer is, it's Raymer's largest mural to date. It pays tribute to Savini for his work in horror films like Dawn of the Dead, Creep Show, and Friday the 13th. And in fact, he's holding the Jason mask from Friday the 13th in this mural. Savini lives in Bloomfield, where he was born and raised, and he gave his blessing for the mural. Raymer calls him a living legend as a makeup artist, and he really is. He's a makeup artist, stuntman, film director, teacher, and author, and he says it's an honor to pay tribute to him in his hometown. Mm -hmm. And then we also have another mural that we want to show you if we can. It's called the Liberation Wall, and this was created by artist Kyle Holbrook. And he started this mural three years ago to mark black history events. It goes chronologically, starting on the left with figures like Lena Horne, Jesse Owen, and civil rights activists. To the right, you'll find recent victims of, of racial violence and police brutality. Holbrook wrapped up this mural this week by adding images of George Floyd, Ahmaud Arbery, and Breonna Taylor. Now look for this mural on the side of the Community Empowerment Association building that's on Kelly Street in Homewood. Holbrook says it is his largest mural to date, and there is room to add more, but he's hoping not to end it on a violent note, but to also add images of people offering solutions for the future, and it certainly is impressive. Yeah, the Liberation Wall is part of the MLK Mural Community Project founded by Holbrook to help kids get involved in their community work through public art, and so far they have created more than 300 murals in the county. Share what's good in your neighborhood. You can email us at ptl at kdka.com, and we'll feature you.